What's up guys, it's the only Ninja Warrior, Aviators and Superhero, bringing you another video here on the Modern Ninja channel, and uh, I just want to start off by saying Happy Thanksgiving to all, and today is also the uh, one of the last days of the um, Avatar Month here on the channel. So to celebrate Avatar Month today, we're going to be going over a Martial Arts Explained video over real life earthbending, or at least the... Um, inspiration for earthbending in the series, and that is Hungar Kung Fu. Hunga or Hungar Kung Fu is a southern Chinese martial art that belongs in the southern Shaolin style. Hallmarks of this style are the deep and low stances that root people to the ground, most notably horse stances, and the strong hand techniques like the tiger claw or the hammer fist. The stance and rooting aspects of this art are such a major part of what makes this what it is that students will spend months and even years just on stance training. Hungar can trace its origin to 17th century South China, with legend saying that Shaolin monk Ji Sin Sem Si was in the heart of its creation. And let me tell you, it took me way too many tries to be able to say that name correctly. When the Northern Shaolin Temple was burned down, many took refuge in the Southern Temple in the Fukin province. There it is thought that Ji Sin Sen Si, eh, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go with Ji Sin for right now truly launched the new style of Kung Fu. A monk named Hung Higan, who was one of the refugees, became the number one student of Jin Si. He also helped to further teach this to future generations. Now, the original curriculum is a topic of some debate still, but it is generally considered to consist of taming the tiger fist, tiger crane paired form fist, five animal fist, and five wire fist. Taming the tiger fist is a long routine that trains the students in basic techniques of hungar and builds endurance. Tiger crane paired form fist builds on taming the tiger by adding vocabulary to the student's repertoire. This reinforces the basic techniques and begins to teach traditions. Five animal fist, also known as five animal, five element fist, serves as a bridge between external force of the tiger and crane and the internal force of the iron wire. The five animals refers to the use of the characteristics of five specific animals being the dragon, the snake, the tiger, the leopard, and the crane. I'm getting some Kung Fu Panda vibes here. The five elements refer to classical Chinese elements of earth, water, fire, metal, and wood. Iron Wire Fist builds on internal power. Basically, it's a combination of martial arts and meditative breathing with some isometric exercises and dynamic tensions. Often, weights were used to enhance the practice, enhance the conditioning of the practitioner. Now, there are some very popular martial artists out there that actually train in this style of martial arts. Starting off with Gordon Liu. Hi, do you know who I am? I'm Master Killer? No. I'm Sander? No. I am Gordon Lao Ka Fai. YouTubers from the Marshall Club channel? <laughs> And one of my favorite martial arts out there right now, Donnie Yin. Oh, would you do uh, non-action? Yeah. Why? Why do non-action? Action movies fun. And of course, you know, Earthbenders. Now, 
Now, all right guys, I know this is a relatively short video. I am sorry, I just, you know, it's the holidays and I got things to do, food to cook and family to be with. So I hope you enjoy this video regardless. Enjoy your time with your family if you are able to be with them. I know some of you out there, myself included, have to work on Thanksgiving. So if that's you, I'm, I'm, I feel you, I'm with you. Let's, let's rock it and enjoy the time we can out around that day. But for all the rest of you guys, I enjoy your Thanksgiving. Be very thankful for being able to enjoy your Thanksgiving. And don't forget that I'm doing a giveaway. Links or, or that's information down in the description. But if you're interested, definitely check that out. So until next time, don't forget to do all the YouTube normal stuff. Give Drop it a like. Maybe uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And if you are, consider hitting that bell so you don't miss the next video. But until then, my name's DJ Moore. This is The Modern Ninja, and I'm out.